Are you excited for tomorrow? Is tomorrow Saturday? A little chicory perks up the taste of roasted coffee beans. It's a good thing. Well, I think it's a crappy thing. The solution to our problem is spread before us. Now get to work, sport. We're counting on you. Three things. We pray to love thee more dearly, to see thee more clearly, to follow thee more nearly, day by day by day. When did you become such a stitch? What madness is this? Hi, everybody, and welcome to NSS. This is the Reynolds Report. Johnny Depp is not walking away from the latest Fantasy Beasts film, Empty Handed. He'll be compensated his full eight-figure salary for Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them 3, following his recent exit from the franchise, days after losing his libel case in the UK where a newspaper had labeled him a wife-beater. Depp had only shot one scene since the start of production on September 20th, but due to his pay-or-play contract with no morale clause, he was able to receive his full salary, regardless of whether the film was made or recast. From pitching wedge to pond to pin, John Ram skips to a hole-in-one on number 16 at the Masters on Tuesday. for things I've learned from movies. We are entitled to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. <laughs> what you people have to realize is that despite having these rights, very few people exercise them. And it is that type of apathy that corrodes our country from within. Hmm? And that said, for things I've learned from the weeks. Trump attended the Veterans Day ceremony at Arlington National Cemetery Wednesday. This draft-dodging bone spur asshole laying a wreath somehow is ironic and frankly quite nauseating. Amazon's pre-Black Friday sale is called Holiday Dash, or as I'm calling it, Holiday Maxed Out Credit Card. Research indicates that eating late night damages your memory, which explains why no one ever seems to remember being the one to eat the last slice of cake. New study gives odds that the average American will die from falling out of bed this year at one in two million. How far behind are bed safety belts, do you think? Time for Nobody Gives a Fuck. Orca Bay Foods is recalling Trader Joe's brand gluten-free battered halibut. It turns out the product contains a very dangerous substance called Trader Joe's brand gluten-free battered halibut. Hey, stinky fish. Nobody gives a fuck. Electric car batteries keep catching on fire, which I guess in the dead of winter may not be such a bad thing. Hey, Elon, nobody gives a fuck. And ACDC is rumored to be a frontrunner to play the Super Bowl halftime show. Unless, of course, Tom Brady is playing. Because, hey, a stadium can only handle so much sexuality in one place. Hey, cheaters. Nobody gives a f Thanks, everybody. We have a new episode of the Reynolds Report for you every weekday. Be sure to check out NSS Live starring Frank D'Angelo. Tuesdays and Thursdays for NSS Live.